Gaming is a huge part of my life because uh, I have school, I have family, but gaming is this first one. This is a worldwide search to uncover the next generation of CSGO megastars. Eight professional players serve as captains, and four amateurs will join them to represent their region. Open tryouts, live and online. Your strategy, creativity and whatever else your captain finds will be imperative to building their team. Every aspect of your game will be placed under scrutiny. The team building phase, where five individual players will train and learn to work together to become one unstoppable team. All leading up to one region versus region showdown in Stockholm, Sweden. everybody to Poznan Game Arena in Poland where we will be meeting our captain and also of course our champion from last year, Isaac. I've done many projects in my career but this is like the best one. I love it because I can make some people's dream come true, I can compete again, I can show my CSGO skills to people. So it's like the best project in, in my whole career and I'm so happy that I can do this again. He'll be looking once more to field four amazing players to join his team. Will he be able to repeat the success that he had last year? Only time will tell. This is Join the Republic. Isaac is a great guy to be honest and uh, he's a Polish icon. Everybody just loves him. My boyfriend, uh, Soren, likes Isaac so much, so he wants the same moustache like, like him. I'm come here uh, to meet Isaac and I want to be uh, like him. If you want to be a pro player, if you want to be the best, you have to feel that CSGO is your life. It's really difficult because the, the, player, the player base is huge, um, so only a few people can, can make it to the top. Stage one of the offline qualification runs as follows. Ten people are chosen every hour to play in a match, and then at the end of the day, five of those people will play against five of our online qualifying winners. I win three parts in online qualification, so I come here to finish this tournament offline. It's my dream, represent Poland on this huge tournament. CS is, for me, it's live right now. I come back from work, it's just, it's just CS. Yeah, I'm looking for, for young players that will be the best, I think, for, for them and for Poly CSGO scene. This year I'm really focusing on, on the roles, so if you create a team based on roles and you, you match these players to roles in, in a good way, it's much easier to play Counter-Strike then. Join the Republic can help you get up there to show Polish players and even European players that you're really good and maybe you get picked up by some famous and really good players to play in their team professionally. Dobra, chciałem podziękować za możliwość uczestnictwa w tym wszystkim i bardzo się cieszę, że, że właśnie miałem okazję uczestniczyć w całym projekcie i też na pewno rozwinęło mnie to jako zawodnika. For day two of the offline qualifier, things kick off with seven people from day one and three people from Isaac's own team, the Izaku Boars, who have been helping the entire weekend playing in a match. At the end of day two, when all is said and done, it's time for the announcement of the final four winners who will be joining Team Poland under the captaincy of Isaac. It's always really hard to pick the final four, but I'm really happy about the players I've picked. I'm really happy that Isaac chose me. It feels amazing. I'm still in shock because it's a huge chance for all of us. I'm really happy. After two days here in Poznan, Isaac has finally found his four teammates. Last year he won the entire championship and I think he believes he has a very good shot of doing it again. You do not want to miss a thing. We will see you in the next episode.